need some more information. So let's say we're trying to find whoops, this here, and we know that this is, um, let's say this is 75. Sure. I don't know if that works. Um, okay. So we have the two triangles here. So the pieces of information that I'm going to need is this first, and then I can use that to get the whole side, and I can figure this out second. Okay. So that's why it's a two triangle problem. All right. First, we're going to have to use tangent because we're using our adjacent and our hypotenuse. So the tangent of 14.8 is equal to our opposite, 75, uh, whoops, 75 divided by, um, we don't know, number one, whatever this is, Let's call it x, x. Rearrange the formula, x equals uh, 75 divided by the tan of, there's the bell, 14.8. Good entertainment right here. Uh, 75 divided by 14.8 tangent equals, I'm in radians, uh, 75 divided by 14.8 tangent equals 283.86 meters. All right. So I know that the total distance is going to be 384 meters. I'm going to round it off here. So now I'm going to use Pythagorean theorem just to change it up and say my a squared plus my b squared equals c squared. So 75 squared plus 384 squared equals, I'm running out of room here, guys, squared, equals, all right, 75 squared plus uh, 384 squared equals, uh, the answer is 153081, square root that, 391.3 meters. Final answer. All right, so finding the one piece leads me to the solution on the second piece.